Chiefs training camp is underway right now in St. Joseph. The QBs and the rookies have reported and they are working on the field. Right now, though, there is a lot of pressure on the newcomers. Our Danny Welniak is live in St. Joe now. And Danny, you spoke with one newcomer who has ties, family ties, in fact, to the Chiefs. Yeah, Ellen, the battle for the backup tight end spot is absolutely fierce out here in the early days of Chiefs training camp. And what's crazy is that two of the main contenders are actually former college quarterbacks. You have John Lovett, who was the quarterback for Princeton just last year, and Blake Bell, the Bell Dozer, the Wichita native, who was a quarterback for OU just a few years ago. But now, obviously, both of them making the transition to tight end in the National Football League. And Bell's name should sound familiar to all of you Chiefs fans. His dad and his uncle both played in the NFL, but Blake's uncle, Mike, actually played defensive end for the Chiefs for 12 seasons. So he is no stranger to Kansas City and Arrowhead, especially since he grew up just down I-35 in Wichita. Blake says he still remembers going to Chiefs games with his family. Yeah, we, uh, we used to come to the games all the time since I've been really young and, uh, you know, I remember having a picture with Tony Gonzalez back when I was young and, and, and everything, but it's it's been great. And obviously my uncle playing here for so long and, and kind of following them growing up. So uh, it's, it's great to be here and I'm and I'm uh, just pumped to be a part of it. So the veterans will report tomorrow just across the street over at Scanlon Hall. And guys, you do not want to miss what Anthony Sherman will be rocking. Last year it was a singlet. We'll be surprised what he has this time around. Live in St. Joe, I'm Danny Walney at KCTV 5 Sports. Yeah, he's always entertaining, so we look forward to that. Danny, thank you.